So Joe, what's your new job like? Really good. I'm working in a factory. How's your job going? I've had a terrible day. I've just done paperwork non-stop. Ah, oh, well don't worry mate. It's nearly Christmas now. Just you think. Another three more weeks and then we're going to have a break off. Sounds good, doesn't it? I hope this train arrives soon. I've got places to go to. What was that? So then, Harry, any requests? I'd like to go to the moon, Doctor. Okay, then. I have had some past experiences with the moon. Once I even saw a space base. Let's go there. Doctor, what on earth is going on? The TARDIS is being dragged off course. Try and hold on to something. My goodness, why on earth is there all that shouting? There's a monster in the tunnels! Can you describe to me what this creature looked like? It was green, and it broke out of an ice block. Hmm, it sounds very peculiar. I've come face to face with a creature like that before. Except it was from the planet Mars. No, but it can't be. Can't everyone stop screaming? I will catch the creature myself, so there's nothing to worry about. It's going to kill us all! You're overreacting. The only thing it wants is me. That's why it's come here, so it can kill me. Stay here, and you'll be safe. Come on, Harry. Let's go and look for that thing. Doctor, where is this thing? I don't know, Harry. Come to play a bit of hide and seek, are we? Come on, show yourself. I know you're there. Uh, this is going to be trickier than I thought. We're going to have to find the thing ourselves. There's no one down there. But this can't be a trick. Obviously, they saw something. You try so hard, Doctor. You look everywhere. You might have figured out my plan, but you will not stop me. Well, if it isn't a nice warrior, the description the man stated was too obvious. It was going to be you all along. What have you got planned this time, eh? <sighs> You say clones. You don't have that amount of technology, do you? So how will you accomplish that? Your blue box. It has a crystal in the centre of its heart. We will use that to power our machine. And then we will kill you. There's no way I'm letting you near my TARDIS. Doctor, we're defenceless against it. What on earth are we going to do? Don't you worry, Harry. I've got it all planned out. Whatever, Doctor. But I will defeat you this time, once and for all. Harry, go back to the TARDIS and amplify the sound with all the cables you can find. Good luck.
Right then, let's go back to the tunnels. If you're looking for the TARDIS, it's all the way down those tunnels, so I guarantee you will not get there soon. It will take a very long time. <sighs> I didn't get there before you, Doctor! You know that! Howdy! Now! Harley, we need to run fast. Those cables are generating too much electricity. Eventually this will explode. There's nothing we can do about it. Doctor, we could have saved him. There was no time to save him, unfortunately. Those cables were generating too much electricity. We should have switched them off minutes before and then the explosion wouldn't have happened. Anyway, what is done is done. Right then, let's go back to the TARDIS, Harry, for some more adventures. <laughs>